the registration of births and deaths amendment bill 2023 has been passed in the parliament and this bill aims to make birth certificate a mandatory document for almost every sphere of life from admission in educational institutions inclusion in the voter list appointment in central and state government jobs issuance of driving license and passport it shall now be mandatory for hospitals and medical institutions to provide a copy of all death certificates stating the cause of death to the local registrar apart from the family of the deceased. The bill introduces the concept of digital birth certificates intended to serve as a comprehensive document for multiple purposes, reducing the need for multiple documents to prove birth details. The bill proposes linking Aadhaar details of parents and informants to birth certificates. This expands the scope of Aadhaar inclusion to various reporting authorities, including medical officers, jailers, and managers of institutions. A centralized database will be established to manage birth and death records, facilitating efficient service delivery and maintaining accurate and up-to-date information. Apart from birth certificates, the centralized database will also update the national population register, ration cards and property registrations. The bill proposes to make it obligatory for states to register births and deaths on the center's civil registration system portal and to share the data with the Registrar General of India, which functions under the Union Home Ministry. The centralized database could enhance administrative efficiency by providing a reliable and unified source of information. Access to educational admissions, government jobs, passports and more can be obtained using a single document, the Digital Birth Certificate. The bill's provisions may potentially conflict with constitutional rights such as the right to education and the right to privacy. Denying admissions to schools based on the absence of birth certificates could infringe upon the fundamental right to education. The bill has sparked a debate about striking a balance between leveraging technology for administrative efficiency and safeguarding citizens' right to privacy. The bill has faced opposition on grounds of transparency as well, with critics questioning the government's approach to data collection and usage. Critics also argue that digital birth certificates may inadvertently exclude individuals who lack access to digital platforms, creating potential disparities in accessing services. Subscribe to the Federal's YouTube page for more news and updates.